not giving an responded to s request to force the producer to submit to a deposition in her lawsuit against the kardashian jenner family in court documents obtained by us weekly seacrest 44 claims there simply is no legal or factual basis to subject him to a deposition because he had nothing whatsoever to do with the events giving rise to this action and has no relevant testimony to offer The papers also call China's motion nothing more than a continued campaign of harassment. In addition, his lawyers requested that she be ordered to pay him $2,460 for the burden he incurred. According to other court documents in the case, the Live with Kelly and Ryan co-hosts company productions opposed China's request to subpoena their business records. The company claimed they already gave the 30-year-old reality star's legal team 800 documents and asked that she be sanctioned $1,950. Furthermore, productions have alleged that Buna Murray Productions was 100% responsible for the physical production of Rob in China, along with the show's concept, content and day-to-day -day production. The former claimed to be merely a passive executive producer, adding that productions had no involvement in the decision to cancel the show, in fact, such a decision was not within its power. China alleged in court documents obtained by us in February that Seacrest refused to appear for a deposition, though he had direct involvement in and has personal knowledge of the specific events that gave rise to this litigation. The American Idol host previously said he had little to no direct involvement with the production of Rob in China. The model's lawsuit against and claims that the family had Rob in China cancelled by publishing defamatory materials about China. She also accused, with whom she shares two-year-old daughter Dream, of assault and battery defamatory statements and public slut shaming in the wake of his 2017 social media rant against her. Seacrest, for his part, was an executive producer on the 2016 reality series, which aired on E! for one season. The lawsuit will go to trial, according to a November 2018 court ruling. Emails between Clo, 34, and Killy, 21, were released in December 2018, in which the sisters corresponded about ending Rob and China. I feel very strongly about cancelling season 2 of ROB and China, the lip kit mogul wrote in December 2016. The only reason China wants to be with my brother is for this show. She does not love Rob and their relationship is too fake and destructive. The Good American co-founder added that she and her sisters were even considering not moving forward with keeping up with the Kardashians if Rob and China continued filming.